Hi everyone, uh, my name is Glenn Savoy, I'm the MLA for St. John East. This is the last in a series of videos uh, that Cheryl Gillespie and I have been doing to try to raise awareness uh, on the prosthetic eye issue here in the province. So Cheryl, uh, a year ago, approached me uh, to try to help her uh, in her fight to have people who cannot get private health care coverage and who also do not, uh, are not part of the social welfare system to be able to help them get coverage uh, in, in the sense of a copay system with their prosthetic eyes. And uh, Cheryl and I, in our series of videos, and you can see them on Facebook, you can see all the information that we've shared. Um, Cheryl has been wonderful uh, through this process. She's really helped to raise the issue in the province. And part of the purpose of these videos is to have you uh, out there, the people of New Brunswick, to get out there and reach out to the health minister and let him know how important it is that the government help people in Cheryl's position uh, receive a little bit of help um, with covering the cost of replacement and cleaning for their prosthetic eyes. So if you would, again, as I've been asking in all of these videos, please share these videos with all of your social media contacts and please take the time to email Victor Boudreau, he is the health minister in the province of New Brunswick, please email him uh, with the subject being prosthetic eye coverage and have him, have him know that it's important to you that, that New Brunswickers get the help that they need. Cheryl is a taxpaying citizen of this province and can't get the help that she needs in order to defray the cost of her prosthetic eyes. So please email Victor Boudreau at victor.boudreau at gnb.ca. I want to thank you all who've been able to follow all these videos and thank you in advance for the support and taking the time to reach out to the government and Victor Boudreau and ensuring that people like Cheryl are treated with the dignity and respect that they deserve as taxpayers in this province. Thank you all very much.